today I'm showing you guys how I've been keeping my makeup on all night lately on my oily skin. So the first product that I used was a Fenty primer. Um, I forgot to show it on screen, but I show everything else that I use in this video on screen and it's also in my description box. Next, I started to set my face before foundation, well before any makeup at all with this e.l.f. setting spray. And this is what I think really, really, really helps me keep my makeup on on. Next, I go in with my foundation. I've been using this foundation for years. It's in every video of me doing my makeup, I think. And I go in with this LA Girl Concealer. I've been using this LA Girl Concealer also for so long. I just can't let it go. Maybe one day, but not today. And after I have all of that blended out, I go in with a second concealer from e.l.f., which is a hydrating product. You'll notice that in this video, I do use a lot of like dewy hydrating products, even though I have oily skin. But that's because I don't necessarily like to look completely matte. I like to look dewy. I just don't like to look excessively oily. In this routine, I really, 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 really believe helps keep me maintain the look that I want all night I can go to parties I can go out to eat I can do whatever I want and my makeup will sit all night without me even having to do any touch-ups so now I'm just blending out my second concealer and blending it in with my foundation before I go into my blush which is one of my favorite parts of doing my makeup I'm using a cream blush today I'm also using a powder but that's a little bit later on first I'm going in with my cream and getting that all over my cheeks and I was on FaceTime by the way the entire time of this video so don't mind my mouth moving and I blend out that blush with a dome brush I have a video where I show you guys exactly what brushes you need to do your makeup so you should check that out so now that I have all my liquid products on I go in with my setting powder and I'm just getting that into all of my concealed areas setting powder also helps in keeping your makeup like unmovable unbudgeable party proof sweat proof eat and prove being out all night prove whatever and you want to really make sure that you set your face really really well especially if you have oily skin like me so I'm going in with my pressed powder and this one is from MAC which is also helping to set my face powder is very important you can't just put creams and liquids and think that your face is gonna sit all night because you're gonna look very silly in about an hour when your makeup start doing a lean with it rock with it and it's all over the place but now I'm using another MAC pressed powder to bronze my face and contour whatever the girls like to call it I like to look really bronzy and now I'm going in with my second blush this is a powder form blush though and listen gorgeous gorgeous girls always over blush um the girls that get it get it I do overdo the blush and I really don't give up I really don't care I like it I think it looks cute so I'm gonna keep doing it until I don't like it anymore <laughs> I must be on drugs. I don't know why I'm in such a good mood today. But yeah, I'm just blushing my nose now before I move on to snatching my nose. And I'm just using the same bronzing powder, contour powder, whatever you want to call it, to snatch my nose all the way up to my eyebrows. And now I'm using like this dew balm to act as my highlight. Like I said earlier in the video, I like to use products that are like kind of dewy and they make you look glowy even though I have oily skin and oily skin people usually be scared of these things but I don't care I'm gonna do it anyway next I'm setting my face with a dewy finish setting spray here we go with the dewy and I like to tap that in with my beauty blender and then I go in again with my finishing spray which is the elf spray that I used before I even put any makeup on my face and I really go in with this spray and baby my makeup will sit all all night i'm telling you you have to try it hey girl hey now i'm going in to do my lips i have all these lipsticks i was showing my cousin on facetime and how much you want to be i'm gonna do the same lip routine every time but this time i actually did try to switch it up so i'm using this morphe liner to line my lips and then i go in with a nyx mac a NYX matte lipstick and I'm going in with a NYX butter gloss. I've never used this butter gloss before. I really like how it looks. I pretty much always do like pinky nude lip combos and that's just my thing. That's just, I'm sticking beside it. 
until I'm not. And the last thing, well, almost last thing that I do is apply my mascara on my top and bottom lashes. And I've showed you guys this before. My brow gel is actually got to be. I don't feel in my eyebrows when I do my makeup anymore, especially if they're freshly threaded. I just like to put them in place with my got to be and my spoolie. And boom, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to take on the world. And I don't even have to carry a whole bunch of powders with me because my face is going to sit. I'm telling you. I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this video. Let me know if you tried any of these products out. If you did like this video, please like, comment, and join the Brat Gang. Subscribe to my channel. I can't believe that this product actually works this well for my oily skin. But I'm going to go take some pictures. And I'm going to come back in about six hours to show you what my face looks like. And it looks like this. Again, keep in mind that I use a lot of dewy products, so my face is never going to look matte, and that's what I like. My hair was more messed up at the end of the night than anything, and I love that. But yeah, this is my routine. This is what I'm doing. Let me know if it works for you, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.